One morning when I got to school, I was sitting at a bench around an olive tree. I remember that I didn't finish my math homework, so I started to finish it. I was stuck on a problem, so I started to stare at the sky. My friend showed up and asked me if I wanted to compare answers. Even though my homework wasn't finished, I still said yes. My friend was about 13, and I was about to be 13. While we were comparing answers, my elective teacher walked by. She was short, with big eyes, and was kind of old. She noticed that we had each other's papers, so she came over and snatched the papers out of our hands and asked us if what teacher the homework was for. We both told her the same math teacher. She looked at both of our papers and noticed that my paper wasn't finished. She asked me if I was cheating. I knew that I wasn't. I knew that we were just comparing answers. So I told her that we were comparing answers. My teacher didn't believe me. She gave our papers to my math teacher before school started. I was scared that I was gonna get detention or Saturday school or a really bad punishment even though we were comparing answers. All that morning while I was sitting in the front of my first period social studies class, I couldn't concentrate, even though that was the class I was having the most difficulty in. So I tried to spend the most attention so I could pass. My social studies class had five rows of desks facing the front of the class and two rows facing the cabinet with the standards on them. The wall had a lot of posters of famous people in sports, but I didn't know who they were. Anyways, I was so scared, and by the time I wasn't very scared, my class was over. Mainly because it was Wednesday, so we got out early. I went to my second period class, and I remembered that my friend was in that class. By the time I got a chance to talk to my friend, my math teacher already talked to her. Then the very next morning, my, my math teacher called my first period and asked me to leave. So I went over to her class, and she said that if I did that one more time, that I was going to get Saturday school. So from this situation, I learned that looks can be deceiving.